Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and I uh, wanted to come back to one of the issues that uh, is plaguing some users still and um, the fix has been sent to most manufacturers honestly. Um, so there was a report that some system has stuttering issues in AMD chips with FTPM enabled and that was both for Windows 10 and Windows 11. It happened sometime in March, February, March of this year. And starting in May, there was a rollout that was done. And the rollout, of course, is done by the manufacturer of your hardware, most part. So if you have that problem, uh, first of all, of course, make sure you have an AMD uh, processor with FTPM. So you can go into the device manager and simply look at processor. And if you see anything that is um, anything that is AMD um, Ryzen or things like that, well, there's a fix for your PC that's uh, pretty guaranteed. What you need to do for most computers is update your UEFI firmware. And to do that, you need to go to the manufacturer of your PC. So if it's a brand PC, go to whatever company that you purchased it from, uh, Acer.com, HP.com, or whatever. Go there, find your exact model, and find in the support page in the downloads your UEFI or BIOS firmware update that they have the latest there, you will download it. It will actually flash and, and, and reinstall a new version of and upgrade your UEFI firmware. And technically, it should be fixed because most manufacturers have pushed the update. Some slower than others, but as we are mid-August, uh, most manufacturers that I have actually was uh, looking at uh, seem to have an updated UEFI firmware. So look at the date. If the date of the firmware or BIOS update from the manufacturer is, you know, May, June, July, um, that means you should have the fix in there. And if there is no update, if the updates that you have there is old, then your manufacturer is really, really taking its time or is not planning to release any fix. Remember also that it could also be something else that makes the stuttering and that is something to make sure that you update all the drivers on your system. Make sure that when you right click on the taskbar start menu, uh, if you go to the task manager, look at what is uh, taking all of the power of your PC, what is actually taking doing something that maybe brings your CPU to 100% or does something weird. Look at what application it is. It could be dependent on something else, not just the FTPM stuttering that happened back then. And one last thing that I would look at, because I think a lot of people are uh, unaware of this, is go on your uh, settings and in the settings app, Make sure that if you look at in the uh, personalization and if you look at the uh, background picture color and slideshow, make sure that change picture every, you know, by default, it's one minute for a lot of, uh, of background wallpapers. That will actually stutter any gameplay that you do because the picture will change while you're trying to game. Change that an hour, six hours or one day. Uh, that could be cause of stuttering also. But um, check out your manufacturer's website for your uh, update. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.